Hi Queens, welcome back to another daily vlog. It is Thursday. We have lots to do today. Um, I have a little haul. I have to, actually two hauls. I ordered some stuff from Sephora last week. Um, so I want to unbox that with you. I have some more black owned brands. I appreciate all of the positivity on that last video. Um, again, I'm just going to try to share things as I find them. I'm really focused on finding black owned brands that speak to my style and just make sense for what I like and what like really fits into my lifestyle. Um, so I found two brands um, that I'm going to share, do a little try on. What else? Oh, I got my jewelry that I ordered from the last vlog when I talked about Misoma. I bought my own like additional things. So it's basically just like all hauls. <laughs> um, what else? What else are we going to do? Oh, I have to prep tomorrow's YouTube video. Don't mind my voice. Allergies are killing me all week. Um, and it's also a thousand degrees. Um, but I have to prep tomorrow's YouTube video, which will come in handy. Um, I let everyone vote on my community page and you guys voted for um, summer outfits for extreme heat. So we have to prep that today and kind of pick out all of those outfits. So I'll be prepared tomorrow. I'm going to quickly turn you around and show you my outfit. It's super simple. Maybe I shouldn't show you. Maybe I should include it in the summer outfits to beat the heat. Hmm. That would be rude though. I'll turn you around and show it to you. Okay, here's my outfit. And this video will be after, will come out after the summer outfit. So it's fine if I show it <laughs> tomorrow. Um, again, everything is a mess in the house. So please don't judge. We're moving. Um, so this is the outfit. This is one of my favorite classic white shirts. It's the Ghani shirt. They have it every season. I will link it below. But it's a wrap shirt. And I usually wrap it in the front. But since I have this little skirt on that has a slit, I just tied it in the back. Cute little bow action. Um, and then this is a Reformation skirt. Um, yeah, it's just super simple. It's very, very lightweight and comfy. Little sex appeal, but again, it's really nice to like wear casually. And then I have on these little black shoes by Dolce Vita. They're super comfy, super cute. So, that is um, my outfit. I will link it below. Everything is always in the description box too if you like something you see in the video. And if you don't see it, just um, leave a comment and I will try to update it for you. Um, also, I did my hair a little different today. I like pushed it up. I also need a relaxer, so there's just a lot going on. But let me know what you think. I mean, it probably looks the same. Before we jump into the video, I want to quickly thank today's sponsors, which is Caseify. They are um, a phone case brand and they sent me some super, super, super <laughs> cute phone cases. So I'm going to show you. Um, but of course, this part of the video is in partnership with Caseify. So let me grab those. I'll be right back. Okay, I had to find a seat. We're back in our <laughs> only clean area of the house but again this part of the video is sponsored by Casetify so if you've never heard of them I'm sure you have but if you've never heard of them they specialize in military grade kind of like drop proof phone cases and lord first of all it was time for me to get a new phone case um but they I picked out like four um and they are so cute I already have one on my phone I've had it on since I got the package look how cute so my phone is gold um, but so I just got it with clouds and then this little bumper thing. I think that's what it's called. But how cute is that? I have an iPhone 10 X, the big one, but it's a 10. Um, but that is the first case I got. So, so cute and good price points too. But again, it's military grade proof. <laughs> you can drop it and nothing will happen with your phone. I'm going to insert a little clip right here um, to give you an example. Yes, that's right, a clip of me dropping my phone to show you. You're welcome. You have it. We did our little drop. <laughs> my phone is intact. She's totally fine, still cute. The case is still in literally perfect condition. Let me show okay. you the other one. This is so cute. Oh, look at this. I'm so plain, but this is so like girly, but simple. Of course, I have a discount code. You'll get 20% off um, if you go to you can actually just go to the url of course it'll be linked below um but if you go to casetify.com backslash janae 
and you will the discount will be automatically applied <gasps> how cute is that i had this is the first time i tried it on my phone oh it's so cute so this one because it's always hard for me to decide black marble or white marble i fell in love obviously because it's both first all of these will be linked below along with um the url so you can save 20 percent off so it's just casetify.com backslash janae i'll put it right here and you can save 20 percent off any phone case um so now what are we going to do should we do a try on hmm. or should i do the jewelry there's so many things to show or should i do the sephora unboxing let's do the try on we haven't talked about clothes in a while let's do that back let's in go. the closet so i have two brands that i am gonna show you guys the first one is the modern day collection let me make sure i have that right yes the modern day collection and she sent me a few things but we've been like instagram friends for a very long time um and she started a brand so I was happy to share some of her items. And then the other brand is Shop AU. I'm sure I'm putting both of these on the screen in case I say them wrong. Um, and this is another creator that I follow and she started a brand as well. So I bought something from her. So I will do a quick little try on, show you both. Okay. Are you dying? Are you dying? <laughs> this is from the Modern Day Collection. And it's just too good. It's just too good. Mind you, I literally, I just took this out of the box. So like, it's only going to get better. It's only going to like poof out more. There's a few wrinkles that are going to come out. I saw it. I said, hello, birthday dress. Hello, I don't know, renew my vows dress. Hello, walking around my new house dress. I don't, I mean, does it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter. Um, she's pink, she's tall, she has a train. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh my God, look at her. I need some heels on. She has a little underneath layer so you are not naked and, what I look, can you see how much I love this dress? I wish I had somewhere to go right now. Um, but they have little clear straps, which is genius. Um, so just depending, like I probably wouldn't wear the straps if I was taking a, a photo. But if you were like really celebrating something and you were gonna be like out and having fun and dancing, this is fantastic. You don't have to worry about um, your dress coming down. It's, I'm so impressed. Has a little bow here. You can even take this off, I was thinking. And like, if you wanted to do like a statement belt, like you could just, you could do so many things with her. Obviously this is not like an everyday thing, um, but it's just so special. And I'm just so impressed with the quality and I'm just so happy for her. So, um, of course I will link this below. And she has a lot of like really pretty statement dresses, um, which I think is is a good option because I feel like that's hard to find when you like have somewhere to go or something to celebrate and you just want something really nice. I feel like it's hard to find, especially black, black owned brands that do that very well, that won't like break the bank. So now we have, now we have this. Oh, I feel like a cupcake and I love it. Okay. Let me try on the next, I, both of the things I'm showing you are pink. <laughs> Who am I? I mean, pink is my favorite color. Black is my favorite color to wear, but this is just too good. This is just too good. I feel like I should be in a perfume ad. <laughs> okay, let me try on the next thing. Okay, here is the next item from the Modern Day Collection. And I got it too big, but I still want to show it to you because I'm going to um, exchange it for a smaller size. Um, but it's super cute. I'm most impressed with both of these items with the material and the quality. It's super soft. Um, I took it out of the box again, so it's a little wrinkled. So blame me for that. Um, but I think a size down, it would fit more like a corset. Kind of like that, yeah. I love this neckline since I cut my hair like some type of squared off 
neckline. I'm trying to show you what it would look like <laughs> if I had the right size. But super cute. All of these buttons are real. So keep that in mind. It takes a little time to put on. Um, but also I like that it's, that just makes it seem like more quality to me. I don't know. Um, that like everything is like functional. So like that again, really, really, really soft, um, like comfy material. So wanted to share that. Hopefully I put the size on the screen that I have. Um, but like my chest is large and I could still um, size down in this. But super cute. I just paired it with these um, black jeans because I like this color combo together. These jeans are from Abercrombie, I believe. But yeah, okay, let me try on the next brand. Yeah. Oh, and she sent me a cute face mask with this one. Oh, how cute. That is a whole vibe. So I definitely have to um, get the... Oh, so imagine I got my size. And we have our mask to match. How cute is this? Oh, it's so cute. Face masks are the way of the world, people. Okay. Moving on. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> okay, next up is this stunner. This is Shop AU. Um, and it's perfection. Green is typically not my color. <laughs> But this print is just so perfect. Um, this is a little pricier, so just FYI. Um, but the quality again is really great, and I was um, pleased um, with like this. To me, is like just a contemporary brand that you would get on Net-a-Porter or Farfetch. So um, I think it's worth the money. Again, I love this neckline. You can also do it off the shoulders, but I really like this square neckline. I think it's so flattering. Um, I wore this last weekend. Look at that waist. That's how the that's how it's structured. <laughs> I mean, I'd love to just claim it that it's me, but that's how it's like that much detail that it makes that hourglass shape. It goes so nicely with my new necklace. Uh, so while we're here, <laughs> might as well show you the Masoma jewelry that I bought that I was talking about in the last vlog. Um, this is one of the necklaces with this little green pendant. It's so pretty. Um, both of these were in the last video, um, but I got this little pendant. Let me get it to focus. There we go. Um, I got that pendant. I got these earrings, which I love. They're like the Huggies. I love them. It's a perfect like not a hoop, not a stud, um, makes me feel like I'm doing something, <laughs> but it's not too much for me. Um, I love them. I haven't taken them off. Like literally since I took them out of the box, I've had them on. Um, I think both of these are part of the Lucy Williams collection, but super pretty. I think I would probably wear this or the grain, like one or the other, but I love the kind of like layered effect I have now. I love the green. It looks like a little vintage find that, you know, you found in like a little shop somewhere. So I really like that. Really like the Huggies. So happy. I just love, I love accessories. So very happy with my purchases. Now, let me slip back on my um, other outfit and then we can do our Sephora <laughs> unboxing. Literally, this should have just been like a haul video, <laughs> but it's so many random things. I don't know what I would have called it. So a vlog it is, but let me show you the things I got from Sephora. <music> So the first thing I got was a bronzer and I'm a contour kind of girl. I'm a contour with the Black Radiance palette. Um, I think it's a Target. And I like that chiseled look, but I've been intrigued by bronzers and more of like a summer glow and just warming up the face. So I got the Fenty Beauty Sunstalker. And it's this or one more shade that's the darkest. And the darkest one seems more um, blushy to me. Like it has like a red undertone and I have more of a yellow undertone. So I just, I felt like that would just look like a blush on me. So my point is I got Sunstalker, but I feel like it just doesn't show up. Um, I have it on, I tried it today. 
let me know if you can see a difference like do I look more I mean I guess I look more bronzed let me know if you noticed the difference before I just said something um because I'm not sure if I should keep it or exchange it and try just something else in general maybe another brand I don't know I still contoured um, but I blended it out a lot and then I just put this like around the perimeter of my face. And I feel like maybe I see a difference, but is it like enough of a difference to add a step to my routine? I don't know. I don't know. The next thing I got was um, the Marc Jacobs Highliner. This, uh, almost all of this is stuff that I was like out of and I just haven't went back to the mall yet since, you know, like the world. Um, so this I ran out of this is just a black eyeliner but these are the best eyeliners um, they're like a mix between like a pencil and like a gel almost like a pot or something they are just super creamy they look like this I want to try other colors but it's also like this is kind of pricey and am I really gonna wear like a colored eyeliner I don't know um, and they just like turn up so you never have to worry about sharpening it Ugh, who has time for that again it's just super black super creamy I have it on today it just like when you put it on I know black eyeliner is not for everyone but I like what I like um next up I got another um NARS natural radiant longwear foundation um mine's is just out so I wanted another one this is what I wear most of the time when I want just like a beat a beat um like what I'm filming for sure and I have shade New Caledonia it's literally the perfect match like when I put it on even if I just put like a swipe on it's just like literally the same color as me and it has a pump which I love so I got that I got um my NARS concealer both of them were out literally I was just like on my last leg of everything and I get Amande and hazelnut I get I'm pretty sure hazelnut is more of just like a natural not really a highlight but a little like it brightens a little bit but it's more just like concealing imperfections and then I always add a little bit of a Monday because that like brightens so I always use both I've tried just using one I don't get the same effect so unfortunately I always have to buy two concealers for the NARS and that was was that everything I bought I got two gifts with purchase one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that was that was a lot of money for like that, that little bit of stuff. Um, but I also am gonna try the Drunk Elephant. They have shampoo and conditioner. Didn't know that. Um, and then I also got a perfume from a brand called Ellis. This is what it looks like. Let's see. Is it focusing? Let's see. There we go. Um, let's see. I got to pick these, so I wanted to try this. Blood orange, clementine, basil, oak moss. Hmm. Hmm. I don't hate it. I kind of like it. It's very summery. It's very fresh. Definitely a lot of citrus. I'll let you know how it wears throughout the day. Hmm. See what Josh thinks. Okay, so that's my haul. That was like super quick, but um, I feel like it's good to show that kind of stuff because you know what like I spend my money on. I know like bloggers, content creators get stuff for free. I don't get a ton of stuff for free because I just don't like a lot of people. I don't like people sending me stuff <laughs> um, that I know I, that I'm not sure if I want, um, but I get some things free. So I like to show the things that I spend my money on too, just so you can have a good balance. What's next? Maybe I see the bronze. Maybe I see the bronze. I think I look more warm, which is what I was trying. I felt like in a lot of the videos, because I look at myself so much when I edit videos, I felt like a lot of them, I looked very like, not ashy, but like almost too cool, like toned. Um, so I, and I'm, again, I have yellow undertone, so I don't have as much warmth, I feel like, in my skin, so I wanted to add a little bit of that, so let me know, let me know, let me know if you see it, let me know. Okay, what next? 
Okay, now that we're done with all of the goodies, we will prep tomorrow's YouTube video. So we're doing um, summer outfits to beat the heat. I think that's what it's going to be called. Or summer outfits for extreme heat. Maybe for extreme heat. Because, um, you know, we got to keep in mind um, SEO and making sure we rank in all those things. So we have to pick that those outfits out and I'm torn between if I want to do 10 outfits or 20 outfits because you guys always every time I do a lookbook you say it's so short but here's the thing <laughs> lookbooks take the longest to film out of any video um I on average will spend like at least two to three hours filming like that's a lot just like continuously like a vlog takes a long take a long time because it's like just pieces of the day but it's not just me standing there like creating for that entire time um and then like taking clothes on taking clothes off styling it up getting the accessories i mean imagine getting dressed and imagine doing that 20 times <laughs> it's a lot so but also i want i want you guys to have more content and the video to be longer so i'm like should i try 20 outfits i mean that'll probably take me four hours to film so we'll see we'll see what we come up with it always comes down to the day <laughs> so when i film tomorrow if I get to like nine and I feel like I'm spent, then it'll be 10. If I feel like I'm, you know, full of energy, then it'll be 20. So we'll pick, we'll try to pick out 20. Oh, that's a lot. So let's go do that. And yeah, so let's go. to give another look at my outfit because it's better light because I moved my mirror um but I really like it uh, again this is a Ghani top reformation skirt uh Dolce Vita sandals and that's it and Masoma jewelry so that's my outfit and my hair is doing like a little swoop thing in the front today but I also need a relaxer and it's just Okay guys, so that is the end of the vlog. I got 16 outfits, so we're just gonna go with that. I'm just gonna call it summer outfits for extreme heat. It's more than 10, it's not quite 20, <laughs> but I think you'll be happy. I think it might be 17, including what I have on, cause it's gonna be in there too. But um, I hope you enjoyed this video. We, we did a lot today. <laughs> Oh, I shared a lot today. Um, of course, make sure you check out Casetify if you want to shop any of the really cute phone cases I shared. You'll get 20% off if you use Casetify. Well, if you go to casetify.com backslash Janae, you'll get 20% off. Um, and I'll link all of the cases I got um, below if you like any of those. And again, I have an iPhone 10 Max. But I think they make the cases. You just pick your phone case. You guys know how phone cases work. <sighs> Okay. Um, of course, if you last this long, make sure you subscribe, 
hit the bell notification so you never miss a video. Follow me on Instagram at Hilolux. Read my blog, hilolux.com. Follow me on TikTok for daily outfit inspiration. I think that's everything. Thanks for stopping by. See ya.